This month we've got to make a simple light pull, which is basically a series of half hitches. For this video, I'm using a length of paracord, about four feet long. I've got to take a piece six, nine inches long and use that as the standing end. And I've got to tie my half hitches around that. That's the piece at the top that you can see at the moment in the video. I've got to tie what looks like an overhand knot using the working end, the longer piece at the bottom. I'm not, not going to tighten this too much yet. I'm going to put a pencil, a knitting needle would do, but I'm using a pencil because I want to hang on to that loop at the end because I need to poke one of the ends through that when I've finished. And now I've got to tie a series of half hitches around the standing end. If you look at the working end, the, the end that I'm holding in my right hand, it appears to be pointing upwards. You see how it's been tied around the standing end? The working end appears to come up from that. When the working end comes up like that, the next half hitch is got to be done by taking the working end round the back first. You'll see when you watch the video. So when the working end is pointing upwards, we do the next half hitch by going round the back first. You'll see what I mean when we start up again. Take the working end round the back and through the loop to tie the half hitch and then a bit of fiddling to tighten it up. Now you'll notice the working end is pointing downwards. So instead of going around the back, because it's pointing downwards, we've got to take it over the front of the standing end to tie the next half hitch. So when the working end is pointing up, we start the next half hitch by going around the back. When it's pointing down, we take it over the front to tie the next half hitch. Pointing up, so we'll start the next half hitch by going round the back. You should be able to see by now the pattern that's emerging, and we we'll continue tying these half hitches until we get the length we desire. continued with my half hitches until my working end and standing end are about the same size. And now I'm going to remove the pencil. The standing end I'm going to poke through that loop that was held there by the pencil. I'm not going to pull it all the way through yet because I like to tighten that loop. Put enough through the loop at the end and the bits at the other end. Pull tight and now if I pull what used to be the standing end I finish up with a ring which constitutes my light pull. Try making this out of different materials. Make the loop bigger, perhaps even smaller. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye for now.